Hey there, what's going on? This is Karen Katengay and in this video I just wanted to show you how you can do a screen capture um, with um, a photo or video using Jing, okay, um, sc screencast uh, from TechSmith. Okay, so we're, we're using Jing. So first is you type in uh, Jing screencast in your browser in, in um, Google search and this is what you're gonna see okay um, so if you do that let me just show that to you you can just type that in and if you see this TechSmith Jing free screenshot screencast software just click this and you're gonna see that and then you're gonna land on this page and then just click whatever is applicable for you if you have Mac then click this and if you have Windows then download uh, using this button all right in my case I have um, a Mac I'm using a Mac so this this is the one that's highlighted, but if you're using Windows, then this is going to be um, what's going to be um, showing as blue on your end. All right, so just download that. Once you download, um, access the, the software um, among your folders. So in my case, um, I have it in my applications, and it's here. Okay, so... Um, once you download that, it will give you instructions on how to install and it will end up somewhere in your applications. And it will, the icon will look like this, okay? It will look like an, uh, a, a circle, a yellow-orange circle, All right? So just click that to open the, to open the, the, the application. And once you open that, what you're going to see is a sun like this, okay? Um, so once it's installed properly, this is how it's going to look like. This is something that you can actually move wherever you want in the corner here so or here uh, at the bottom um, together with the other apps. But for me, I prefer um, placing it here. All right. So once you have it, then you can actually, um, when you hover the mouse, you will see all these um, rays of the sun. And um, when you use the first one with a um, plus sign, that's how you can capture the images. This one is where you can see the history or um, you know those that you have um, captured before. So it's like a, a folder for all your captured images and videos. Um, and this is where you're going to see the other settings. So... Um, send feedback, preferences, um, help, and if you want to exit this, or if you want to quit your Jing, but um, but for now, we're just going to use it and show you how you can capture images. Okay, so for example, if you want to capture this page, um, you just have to go to the sun, to the Jing sun, and click this, which is the capture featured or the capture icon from among the race you can just click this and you can go ahead and highlight whatever you want to capture okay so for example if you want to capture this and share this to your friends or share this to anybody um, on Facebook on Skype I love this because it's so easy you can just you can just do that and then click this the the, the one on the bottom left um, capture an image you see that right so you click that and once you click that, um, you will see that you have options here on the left. But if you don't want to do anything else anymore, um, let's try that first. You can either choose this, share via screencast.com. What, what this will do is that it's going to give you like a URL um, of the image that you are sharing so you don't have to save it anywhere you don't have to upload it anywhere you can just easily click this and it will give you a URL that you can easily share on Facebook so this is what I usually use because um, you know it's so fast it's it's a, a shortcut to uh, when I want to share something so for example that it's it's done almost done um, uploading and once it's done uploading, it will show a message that will say there, uploaded to screencast. And once you see that, that means it's already ready for sharing. What you're going to see is a, what you will have is a um, link to your clipboard. So once you hit paste, 
anywhere else. So if you want to share that on Facebook or Skype or wherever, you will see, you will have this link. Okay, and what, li what this link will do is it will lead you to the captured image. So if you want to, if you want to test that, uh, let's go to a different tab and click that. And this is what you're going to see, right? So the, this is the image that uh, we tried to uh, capture a while ago using Jing. All right, so it's really awesome. I love it. So let's try the other features. I want to show some stats, uh, for example, in whatever business that you're doing um, for some social proof, you can go to your back office. And this is uh, my favorite use for this. I, I do a screen uh, capture. For example, if you want to show your earnings so far, um, and then before you click the capture, you can actually adjust, you know, instead of, you know, you can crop it from here before you actually um, uh, take the take a screenshot. So once you're happy with um, the area, and you can actually move it like this if you want to do that, you can capture the image, and then before you even save or before you share the URL, you can actually do, um, you know, you can you can point an arrow if you want uh, something highlighted. You can act, you can actually click and you can actually change the colors for the arrows as well. You can click this, the highlight feature, and you can change the colors as well. But I want yellow because uh, it's it's meant I want it. I want yellow for highlighting, so you can do that if you want to highlight something. Um, you can also put a box on uh, wherever or whatever you want to highlight. So, for example, if you want to highlight that and you want to highlight, you want to put a box around that, that's also possible. And you can also put a text, which um, you can also adjust the size for this. So, so, after doing that, you can just click this, like what we did a while ago. But right now, what, what I can show you is how you can save it. So you can you can um, change the name. You can put a name here. So for example, um, whatever the date is. For example, December, December ten, earnings, and then you save it. And then it's gonna ask you for the folder where you want it saved. Okay. You can also do this, which is copy, which is um, basically it will just a it will just copy to your clipboard, so you can paste it somewhere if you wanna share it. Um, but for me, the easiest use is when I share it as a link. So I copy, I click this, and then um, whatever you've done here before you click this, it, it's what um, the, the application is going to capture for you. Okay, so I hope it helps. Um, and let me know your feedback. Click the link below this video or subscribe to my channel for uh, more tutorial on internet marketing. All right. Thank you and have a nice day.